is Snapchat dead? No. No, I don't think it is. Um, I think it depends on your your goals as an organization, yeah. your audience, and your comfort level as a creator. And I was actually thinking about this in my car today, which is maybe you're a great Snapchatter and you're you work for a brand and you're you have your own business, for example, and you're a great Snapchatter. Create on Snapchat, and then when people come into your business, let's say you're Chocolate Johnny, right? Yeah. And you love doing Snapchat stuff, sell them on going to find you on Snapchat. Right. And even if they're not on Snapchat at all, take your phone, download Snapchat with them, yeah. in install the app, add yourself as a friend, and now you want to talk about conversion, right. now the only reason they have that app is because of you. Right. When people ask them to use Snapchat, uh, you know, sometimes I use it to watch this guy Chocolate Johnny. That to me is even more valuable than someone who's on Snapchat all the time. Uh -huh. Right? Like, my mom is on Snapchat. My mom watches me and she watches Joe Wilson. Joe Wilson, I love Joe Wilson. Right? So. <laughs> When she opens up Snapchat and she watches and she's like, oh, well, where's the coffee guy? That's huge for yes. Joe. Yes. Right? That, that one follower means more than someone who might just mindlessly tap through. Right. They just wait for the next thing from that person. Right. So yeah. when we talk about the numbers, when we talk about the data, when we talk about you know view time or whatever, like if my mom watches Joe Wilson and then she picks up the phone and calls me, it's like, man, that was awesome. Right. I, I laughed out loud when I watched this so and she calls her friends. That's huge.